The Grammys are right around the corner, and although you probably aren't going, you can take part in a Grammy event. It's called Grammy in the Schools Fest or Gets Fest. It's a virtual event taking place next week leading up to music's biggest night with the Benefit Concert. And joining us now is David Sears, who is the Vice President of Education for Grammy in the Schools. Thanks so much for joining us, David. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. Well, for people who don't know about the event, tell us about Grammy in the Schools. Well, Gifts Fest or Grammy in the Schools Fest is an online program that's going to be streaming beginning Monday at 10 a.m. Pacific. And it's designed to provide music educators, music students, and lovers of music with not only information about behind the scenes in the, in the music business, okay. but also information on how uh, students can perform better, how teachers can perhaps get some tips on how they can uh, improve the, uh, their ensembles. Tell us a little bit more about those special guests. You're kind of glossing over, and you've got some really special <laughs> guests. Yes, we do. Um, each session is 45 minutes long, uh, and some of our guests include uh, uh, the band Switchfoot. We have Jeff Pilson from Foreigner, who is also doing a session. And we have a multi -Grammy, multi Grammy nominee this year, and a previous Grammy winner, Manny Marroquin, is going to do a session as well. Manny Marroquin is a prominent figure in the music industry, and I hear you are called a mixing engineer. Uh, can you explain what that really is? Yeah, um, the creative process is you have a you have an artist, a songwriter. They uh, write the song. They uh, they call a producer to kind of help them uh, arrange the song, uh, create the instrumentation, and then what happens is when they're done, they need an unbiased opinion, and uh, and that's a mixer. And a mixer like myself then comes in, and you can see the board right behind me. Uh, I have everything separated. And instead of telling them or giving them my opinion, I show them by uh, mixing, putting all the sounds together. So you, certainly you think that this program is important for kids and anyone, really? I mean, it's beyond important because I think that we all, you know, growing up in the industry, uh, when I told David I wanted to be a mixer when I was, I don't know, 17 years old, there was not a lot of people that looked like me as a mixer. <clears throat> so I feel like we have that responsibility to have Hopefully, uh, uh, hopefully inspire some of the, the kids that uh, uh, that want to get in the industry. And listen, not everybody is going to be an artist, right? Uh, there's so many different things that you can do and still be in the music industry. And I feel like any, uh, you know, nowadays we just need a little inspiration. And if we can give that off to some kids, that's then that's part of our job. And did the did this program kind of help you even learn about? some of the different jobs that are even involved? I mean, I had never heard about, you know, what you yeah. did. Yeah, you know, I for uh, I was lucky enough to know very early on what I wanted to do and that very specific was mixing. But, uh, you know, listen, like I said, there's uh, there's so many, you know, so many things you can do in the industry. And uh, a lot of a lot of younger uh, kids uh, want to go into uh, thinking that they're going to be artists and that's listen that's fine and that's okay you should pursue your dreams but but at the same time is there's only so many s spots for you for artists so uh uh there's so many other things you can do and i think that having a program like this uh really just shows different people that are doing it as you know making a good living at it uh, and hopefully that inspires them to see other uh, things in the industry that they can be doing and not just be in front of a microphone and, uh, and uh, be an artist. Oh, that is amazing, Manny. Thank you so much for your time. Let's talk a little bit more about the big concert that uh, is coming up. It's a benefit concert. So let's talk a little bit about the concert and then where the money is going. Yes. Uh, that's a Grammy in the school. It's a Grammy in the school salute to music education, and it's a concert Thursday evening in Las Vegas. It's uh, it's it's the first time we've done this. It's a fundraiser concert. It will feature uh, an opening act of alums from our music programs over the years, uh, and we're calling it the Grammy in the Schools Alumni Band. It's a original name, uh -huh. and. Our uh, guest artist, our headliner, is Nathaniel Rateliff and the Night Sweats. 
Um, this is Thursday evening at the House of Blues at the Mandalay Bay Resort in Las Vegas. Uh, it sounds like so much fun and people can still get tickets and be a part of this, correct? Absolutely. They can still get tickets for that. Um, and we'd love to have them, you know, come to Vegas and have fun with us that evening. It's going to be a really fun evening. It sounds like it. Thank you so much for joining us. We certainly appreciate your time. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me.